Hey, what's going on, folks? Mike from Long Island Shaving, back for another video. Welcome to The Shave Den. Appreciate you guys tuning in for another shave of the day and review of a new soap set that arrived in the den just a few days ago. Actually had an opportunity to spend some time with this scent, so this is not my first impressions. Really wanted to get to know this, and let me tell you, this is an absolute certified banger for sure. It is The Year of the Dragon from Hendrix Classics and Company. What a phenomenal scent this is. And one thing I do know about this set right now is that I'm going to have to pick up the EDP. This is one that you want this fragrance to last all day. And by the way, it's also wife approved. Uh, she really does enjoy this. And look at the label. I mean, the label alone, um, I love the metallic labels that Pete uh, puts on his uh, soap sets. Um, they are truly amazing. Um, but... This is the Year of the Dragon. This is what we're going to be featuring today. And just so you guys know, this is going to be released on Saturday, February 17th. That's when it'll be available at Hendrix Classics and Company. I'll include the link in my description so you can go ahead and purchase it if you're interested. Um, and just also for full disclosure, I received this set at a discount for review purposes. Um, so I'll be giving you guys my honest feedback and my feedback right now is I'm absolutely in love with this fragrance um, and I had a lot of conversations with Pete uh, over time and one thing I will tell you I mean after 2023 he had such a great year um, one set right after the other everything was a banger everything was truly amazing and uh, he's hitting the ground running in my opinion in 2024 and uh, one thing I know from talking with Pete is he puts a lot of research and R&D behind determining what fragrances he wants to bring to the community. Uh, he doesn't just throw things together and say, let's just see if this works. He really does his reach, research, checks to see what fragrances are popular, one, ones that are really highly rated, and determines whether or not he's going to bring that uh, to us in a soap set that we will uh, enjoy. And uh, let me tell you, the Year of the Dragon, um, I think personally, and I think Pete had mentioned this, this is a strong contender uh, of one of the best fragrances of the year. Um, and I, I do happen to agree with that statement. And um, so far, this is a truly amazing scent. And one that I will tell you guys is not even a consideration to sleep on. Um, and I know, listen, I know we all have a lot of sets out there. Um, but you have to appreciate the different scent profiles. And that's why I do what I do. I love trying different things. And it is really amazing to see how different soap sets and fragrances can smell completely different than anything else uh, that you may have in the shave den. I mean, listen, I have 100 plus soap sets in the den, and this doesn't smell anything like um, anything else that I have. So having that experience, uh, that's why I enjoy what I do. Um, and that's why I try to bring you guys this content to share my experiences with you. So... I will be shaving with this again today, so really excited about that. Of course, I have the uh, matching splash. I mean, you can't have a shave without it. So for those of you that just buy the soap, you got to get the splash. All right, Stacks, you got to get the splash too. So that's that. Uh, the razor I'll be cha uh, shaving with today is the Timeless uh, T T I uh, Timeless 95. Um, this is the Open Comb Titanium uh, razor that I picked up a while ago uh, that I like shaving with from time to time and I have the Alpha Shaving Works Outlaw uh, 28 millimeter synthetic knot so that's the knot I'll be shaving with or I'll be brushing the lather on with and of course I'm going to be lathering this um, the Year of the Dragon up in the Hendrix Classics and Company bowl one of the best bowls in the business and uh, yeah there is nothing like it out there. It's uh, truly a great bowl to use uh, in wet shaving if you don't have one. If you don't have one, do you even shave, bro? That's the main thing, right? All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and whip up a lather off camera. And uh, we'll get right into today's shave. And I'll share the set notes with you guys. Be right back. All right, guys, I'm back. I applied the lather just to kind of save some time in this review. So let's get right into today's shave. So let's discuss... Uh, the set notes and what this was inspired by. So the Year of the Dragon, just so you guys know, was inspired by uh, Stranger With You Leather by Emporio Armani. Um, 
I have never experienced this fragrance before. This is the first time for me. And if this is what this was inspired by, it is such a wonderful fragrance. And I know you guys would really enjoy it. So that's what this was inspired by, uh, whether you are familiar with that or not. So let's get right into the scent notes now. Scent notes, the top are chestnut uh, spices, a lemmy, uh, which lemmy is a spicy lemony scent. Uh, the mid notes are sage and lavender. And the base notes are vanilla, leather, gayak wood, and argyle wood, which is oud. Um, the gayak wood is basically like a warm, smoky scent, just to kind of give you guys some uh, idea behind that. Um, you definitely get some, you know, smokiness to this fragrance initially. You definitely pick up the leather notes. That was one of the first notes I picked up when I experienced this fragrance on my own. Um, and I love... Um, leather notes are definitely within my wheelhouse. Um, I'm a big fan of Tuscan leather, ombre leather. I actually have Cowboy, which is an homage to ombre leather. So it's one of my favorite fragrances to shave with and to put on throughout, you know, each and every day. Not every day, but I wear it often. And I get a lot of compliments on that. But um, as soon as I smell the, the leather notes in this set um i was a big fan and it blends so very well with the uh, lavender so you, you definitely get the lavender and the sage um but it's got that spiciness that, that nice kick uh it's a very pleasing uh warm scent and one that i know you will get a lot of compliments with That I shaved, I almost shaved my uh, goatee off. That wouldn't be good. All right, first pass in. So let me just uh, get ready and we'll do the second pass. Hope you guys are doing well. I'm actually doing the shave. Uh, it's Thursday night, so uh, the weekend is upon us. So um, can't wait for that. It's been getting uh, really cold out as of late. So I can't wait for the warmer weather, for sure. Oh, what a great scent. I love this. Um, again, it's, uh, it's a banger, guys. It's, not, it's all I can say about it. It's definitely one that uh, I would not sleep on. And again, uh, as mentioned earlier, it's going to be available on Saturday, the 17th. And you can pick it up from HendrixClassics.com. Uh, this razor shaving well as usual. So a great razor, the timeless. Um, I actually had this razor, uh, once before I sold it. Um, I don't know why I think it happens to many of us. You sell the razor you think you don't want, then you, you kind of want it back. Um, so, uh, I know someone within the community, a friend of mine was selling it. It was available. Actually, I did a trade on it, if I'm not mistaken. And, uh, so now the, uh, timeless titanium is back in the den. Definitely a good razor. I think it'll be good because it is the open comb. It'll be good when I do want to shave this off. I may use this. Yeah, I kind of messed myself up there with a, a razor that I didn't have. Uh, I need to have a little more respect for. I underestimated the efficiency of it. I know I talked about this on my last review. Everything was going well. I did my last cleanup pass, and I think I went I went too much. But it's all right. It'll heal. All right. Second pass done. All right, guys. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to clean this up, and I'll be right back, and then we'll uh, get right into the splash and finish the shave. Be right back. All right, guys. I'm back. 
Uh, really great shave. Base performed really well. Really nice post shave feel even before the splash. Always a good experience. All right, let's get right into the splash. Now again, I've used this before, just to let you guys know, and uh, it is really fantastic, and the longevity is really good on this. Um, I actually put this on last night because I shaved last night, and um, it lasted even through um, the morning when I woke up. I applied a little bit more, but today it lasted for most of the day when I reapplied, so really great fragrance. Nice burn. Oh, yeah. Definitely pick up. The, the leather really pops in this. And it kind of, you know, blends with the with the lavender. And um, you get that smokiness. Um, and the spices. And, you know, now that I kind of think about it, because I didn't pick it up before, I do get the lemony... Um, um, notes from the Alemi. I, I do get that now from the splash. I didn't realize that until now. But on the dry down, that lemony uh, scent profile kind of fades away. And then you kind of left with the, uh, I would say more of the leather and the lavender in the background. You know, that's pretty much what sticks with you throughout the day. Yeah, no, really, uh, really great shave, guys. You're the dragon. By Hendrix Classics again being released on Saturday, February 17th. So be on the lookout. Um, I'll leave, leave in the description the time frame when this will be released, just so you guys know when to expect it. Uh, but definitely uh, a good one to consider for sure. Um, and when it's available, I think I'm going to go ahead and purchase the uh, the EDP for myself personally because I like it a lot. So with that. Thank you very much, guys, for joining. I really do appreciate you guys tuning in today for this review. And again, if you're not subscribed to the channel, please consider doing so. Uh, and leave a comment down below if you got any questions on this review or anything that was covered in today's shave. With that, you guys enjoy the rest of your evening. And uh, I'll see you guys soon. Take care now. Bye-bye.